It never ceases to amaze me. I promise you, it never ceases to amaze me. No matter how many times I speak with people, read your comments, really just sit back and absorb some of what y'all have to say, why do everybody think that this journey is going to be easy? People think that they're going to set out on their own, quit their job, you know, go and put up their sign, such and such incorporated, and all of a sudden they're going to be overnight successes. You know, in, in, in a year from now, I'm going to be a multimillionaire. My idea was better than anybody else's on planet Earth. You know, this was going to be, no, this is never supposed to be easy. Why do people think? that they're gonna be the exception to the rule. Believe me when I tell you, if you are setting out on, on, on this road to success, you are going to be met with pain. And I mean gut-wrenching, like hit over the head with a bottle. Like somebody just hit you in your abdomen type pain. Are you prepared for that? Because pain is coming and it's only part of the process. But be real clear on something. Pain don't run by itself. Pain got a crew, and I mean a crew. Like, like you think the Crips and the Bloods and, and all them different gang, the MS-13s and all them, like, they're tough? No. Be real clear. Pain's crew is unmatched. Right there is his brother, and his name is Fear. And wherever Pain go, Fear follows right behind him. Like, Fear will have you, like, like, and, and just really rock with me for a second because I need to help you to understand. Fear. Fear is like, like that dude who just came home, got that workout physique, like he been in the yard for 8, 10 years straight doing push-ups and lifting every weight in the yard. That's what fear look like. So just to look at him is intimidating. But on top of it, he'll have you like, yo, you know what? I think I got a little ahead of myself. Like, like I, I, I just jumped out the window for a second. Th this job that I thought that I hated yesterday, I'm good. I'm gonna stay right here. Like, no, no, no. I am good right where I'm at. That's what fear do to you. But right next to fear is his homeboy doubt. Like, doubt will, like, like seriously, doubt will have you second guessing yourself the entire way. You will really be thinking to yourself. Am I as good as I think I am? Is my idea as sound as I think it is? Like, like you will be doubting yourself the entire way. Are you ready for that? And that's just the start of it. Like, like you got fear, doubt, and they standing right next to pain. But on the other side, said that the rest of the crew is right there. Rejection. Like, you don't put your resume out to a thousand different corporations. People sending you back notices. Oh, we're not hiring right now. Rejection. You go to the mailbox, another. Rejection. You go in, do your interviews. They call you back. Oh, I'm sorry. We decided to go another way. Rejection. Are you, are you really prepared for that? You going out on your different interviews and you, everybody's telling you the best actor since Denzel Washington. Didn't get the part. Rejection. Oh my God. Again, rejection. Can you handle that? But right next to rejection is his homie. And his name is Setback. Like, let's just say, right? You up and running. Your business is doing good. And then there's this recession. Setback. What the heck? I was doing good just a week ago. Like, I just lost my biggest client, setback. The, the, your first employee who you took in and taught everything. This was supposed to be the person who was going to take all the weight off you and help take the business to the left, to the next level. Your competition just hired him or her, setback. Are you ready for that? Like, seriously, think about it. Pain is part of the process. Like, I really want you to think about Payne and his crew like that. You, you, you watch football, and it's like that defensive line, and they 
big old brawly like got the, the shoulder pads and the helmets on and they uh, uh, like dare you to run through it. I'm like, I wish you would. I can't wait to lay you out and they just waiting for you. But here's the deal. While you have that defensive line looking you dead in your face, all the while, it's this temptation to give up. It's this temptation to quit. You know what? My family had to down. Like, I was going after this dream, and I put it all on the line. You know, we damn near, like, living out of our car at this point for my dream. And it, it, every step of the way, there's going to be this temptation for you to quit. But don't do that. Don't you dare do that. I know how easy it can be to go out there and say, forget this. I've been going at this for years and years and years. And if it hasn't happened now, it ain't going to never happen. I'm going to just go get my safe nine to five. I'm going to do what I do. And, and God willing, I can retire in 20 years. Don't quit. Don't quit. Pain is just part of the process. I know it's easy to quit. You looking at somebody and they on the other side of that finish line and they smiling and, and, and jet setting and the money is like, like they flaunting money, doing whatever they do. And you looking and, and you starting out as, you know, it could only happen for somebody else. It'll never happen for me. I don't even know why I thought that I can be the one. Don't quit. Don't quit. Please understand. If you stand strong, if you are ready to look that defensive line in the face and say, I do not care, I'm getting to the other side of you because that is where success lies. If you have that mentality, I can guarantee success is in your future. But have no illusions. Pain is part of the process. Peace and love make every move a power move and I'll catch you all on the next video. What's up guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love.